So this is a series that it has been ooh, a, a long time since uh, that, that I've put into this. This is my MNJHL simulation um, of the team. So let's let's go. So I did an episode earlier of all the different teams that I created. I'll upload that to YouTube soon. Um, but we have. We'll just go through them again. Entire league. Ileana Blackbirds, the Iron Range Yellow Jackets, the Edina Lakers, the Minnesota Wildcats, the Tri-City Icehawks, the Dells Ducks, the Central Wisconsin Knights, the Ironwood Fighting Upers, the Rochester Icehawks, the Central Wisconsin Saints, the Wisconsin Mustangs, the Central West something Wisconsin River Kings, the Granite City Lumberjacks, the St. Louis Frontenacs, the uh, I guess we'd call them the Metropolitan Kodiaks. They didn't really have a city. Now uh, the Minnesota Flying Aces, the Central Chicago Bulldogs, the Steel County Blades, the Minnesota Owls, the Minneapolis or Twin Cities Northern Lights, the Shattuck St. Mary Sabres, but for some reason St. Mary's wasn't there, but St. Catharines was. Um, the Hudson Crusaders, the Wooster Oilers, the Forest Lake Lakers, the St. Paul Sears, the Wisconsin Rampage, the Dubuque Thunderbirds, the St. Louis or Twin Bridge Lightning, the Marquette Royals, the Maple Grove Energy, the Fort Wayne Federals, and that is our league. So these are all the teams that are, were in the MNJHL um, in some way or another. We split them into four divisions. Eastern Weapons Conference. The Pacific Division is all of the teams that were in the um, the Great Lakes Division that they added on towards the end. Central Division is all of the teams that um, left the league early on um, or uh, were only there for a year. Like the Saints were only in for a year. The Bulldogs were only in for a year. The Steers left really early. The Kodiaks were late 90s team um, the Knights once again they finish early 2000s same as the Yellow Jackets then the Atlantic Division is all of the uh, I guess the MJ in its prime but no longer play so this is 2000 and uh, 3 4 ish up to um, to the to the new expansion of the Great Lakes Division and then we have the Metropolitan, which is all of the teams that people know for playing in the MJ, uh, including the Lights, uh, who went dark their last year. So I went through and um, actually did all the rosters depending on how good their team has played um, over all their years. Um, I did make the Great Lakes Division a bit better than they originally were. Um, I, I base off them off of their league standings in their division as opposed to league standings as a whole because almost every team in the Minnesota division would beat a Great Lakes division team. So uh, I, I also had them form with a different NHL team to create their money management. So like for example the, the lights are the um, uh, the Lightning, because their team is really good, but they didn't have the highest income, so they have an income of, uh, I think it was just, just over $90 million, as opposed to, say, the Rochester Icehawks, who I believe are the Bruins, another really solid team, but they're one of the highest money-making teams in the league, so they make, like, $115 million. So, stuff like that. Um, we'll go through the first few... Um, when we get to the first game of the season. Oh, we play the Bulldogs in our first game. Okay. They want Shvetsnikov. Uh, he's a medium top six forward. Plus a fifth round for a third and fourth round. You know, I kind of like that. But I'd like to throw in like a seventh if I can. Yes, I know how to trade a player. I have done this before. Yes, I know how to play the game.
and then let's throw in like a 2022 seventh rounder. No, you don't like that? Okay, then let's stick with what are that. It's a promotion night. So let's do first home game. That would be against Chicago. Uh, what would we do? Let's do a hat. And then... Maybe when we play Rochester, Granite City. We already have one that month. So we play Rochester just after Christmas. It's a good one to do. Do the puck. We did that one quite frequently. Uh, who who did we play at the last game of the season? We play Rochester. Uh, that's that's a good way to do it. Close out the season. We'll do scarf. Okay, when do we play? I want to do when we play Dubuque, beginning of February, first game of the new year, for the Lakers. So, uh, well, we already did one that. Uh, let's see against the Knights. Vasilevsky bobblehead. Yes. How much more money do we have? Three. Let's do one in November. We don't have one in November. Let's do Shattuck. Shattuck should be an easy win. We'll do another hat. How much do we have? One? Yeah. So, first game of the season, I'm debating whether or not to play a majority of these. Um, just because different arenas, different teams, it's not something I do a whole lot. Uh, just, But I have put a lot of effort into these teams. This is something I'd like to do in NHL 23 with their new customization where you can now set... Um, NHL teams, their AHL affiliates, um, all kinds of stuff. Kind of wish I could do that, but I don't have NHL 23, so. You know what? Let's play the first game. Let's, let's look at some trades. I don't think there's really anything we need to do. Okay, what, what do we need for Flurry? No, he is getting paid seven million. Let's see what I can get for Ingram. That's that's a lot. I have too many goalies, so we do have to get rid of a goalie. Who's, who's our worst? Thirty-year-old. So we got a new, a new like rookie goaltender. Oh, we don't get the cool introduction. That's okay. Okay, I, I don't know what the AI is set to. I'll set it to superstar if it hasn't been. Oh, that was a really bad turnover. Nice job, Vassy. So the Lights have only played the Bulldogs once or twice. It, it hasn't been that often. It was a rare occurrence because they really only played at two showcases. Nice job, Vassy. Oh, we didn't do a fight. Oh, I was going to change the settings to apply the rules. So, like, the trapezoid isn't a thing. Stuff like that. It's one thing that the lights have done a really good job with is their goalies. So having Bassey as their starting goaltender fits really well. 
Oh, and it looks like the goalies actually for franchise don't have their pads, which is what I wanted. Oh, that was a bad play. They didn't let me switch. I guess I traded for him then. Chara, that's his name. That was awful. I'll let the computer take over. <laughs> I doubt we're going to win the game. Yeah, we lost. So with that, I think we'll just kind of sim through. We'll probably do like I do with my normal uh, franchise modes where we play the like that the playoffs I'll probably play it a pro just so that I can be I can relax and play it probably gonna keep a lot of our team together I'm a high team chemistry guy what, who's our captain Kucherov, Stamkos is on the backup. That's fair. Trade, I want a new goalie. I mean, he's an 84, and they do want to get rid of him. Oh, but Ingram has potential. That's what I like about him. Low elite. He could he could really help us in the long run. Let's keep him. I, I can trade him for Hudovin. There really hasn't been that many trades asked other than the knights the first week. I mean, we're playing decently well too. Granted we're eleven and six. Ooh. A third round that's not mine. A third round that is mine. I want to keep the Lightning's third round. Because they're, they're not going to do well this season. Elastic, though, is a defenseman. Let's, let's look. What is Velasic? How old is he? Thirty-three. He's an eighty-five. Mm. Okay. We're done. I do want to trade my first round for another first round. Nobody's really offered me trades, which to me is surprising. There you go. Okay, they want to give me Jordan Stahl plus a third round for two of my third rounds. No. No. But I but I can look at the at the Jordan Stahl trade. Yeah, Jordan Stall costs too much. It costs too much. We lost to Maple Grove six to zero. We lost to Shattuck six to zero. What is the simulation? I mean, because we're almost at the end of the year. We're second in our league behind Maple Grove, who is Pittsburgh. Who would have been an E seven overall team. Or no, they are an eighty seven overall team. They would have been lower, but they had a really good last year. So I gave them Pittsburgh. But their salary is way below Pittsburgh. Ooh, that is tempting. 
So I get rid of a third round. I I think I'll take it. Because I get the Federals third round pick, which is going to be worth more than mine. Plus I get the Wildcats third round draft pick, which is going to be worth more than mine. Yanmark, who I think is okay. Top nine forward. I mean, we're giving away a top four D. Plus the third round that really doesn't matter. I'll do it. And I did set this to, I think, 20 years. Because that's about, oh. Yeah, whatever the length was. It was the actual length of PMJ. I see in the chat. I don't know how long ago that was. I just looked at the chat. Well, am I still playing 21? Because I don't want to pay 60 bucks for 23. <laughs> I also don't have a Series X. And I don't want to pay for the new NHL. Unless I have the new if, if I have the Series X. Let's get to the trade deadline. We're 500 right now. Why are we 500? Okay, I get Trevor Zay, uh, Zay Jack plus a D man for my second round and a low top 4 D. So I'm going to, in exchange, get a top 4 D and I'm trading a second round for Trevor Zajac. Well, I, I need to do well this year, so I will accept it. Actually, now that I'm above below 500, I can trade for my first round now. I'm I'm sixth. Okay, trade deadline day. We need to make the playoffs. That's all I'm asking for. Oh, we should probably repair some stuff. Oh, whoops, wrong button. Okay, I'm a buyer. I need to make enter trade deadline. Yes. Okay, Jonathan Taze. What do they want for him? Top two defensemen. Sold. Is that a top two defenseman? I don't know how to top two defenseman. I have a top four defenseman. Uh, I doubt they're going to want to get rid of him. Yeah. I mean, Taze is worth 10. Jalmerson is taken. What do they want? Return top four defenseman. I can probably do that. For Flurry. I'd have too many goalies. There. So I get rid of my bottom goalie. Okay. <sighs> Alright, we now have Flurry as our backup. Somebody asked me, okay, <clears throat> a third round, a fourth round, and a super cheap starter. I think the front necks are going to do bad this year. So let's do it. 
So I, I just basically sold my draft picks for better draft picks. Mark Stahl. They want a top four defenseman. Do I have a top four defenseman? What's his overall? I don't remember. He's an 82. I think he's going to go up and trade to value. And the fact that he's only getting paid basically nothing. Let's see what goalie I can trade for him. How much are we paying him? Seven. He's only getting paid a year. He's the AHL starter. Or no. That's that's where he's gonna be as a starter. Trade deadline. I think that's fair. I mean, not not a, not a bad trade alert. Taze gets traded. Oh yeah, yeah. So now going past past the trade deadline, where is uh, edit lines? So I still got uh, I got Kucherov, Brandon Point, Kalorn, Palat, Eric Stahl, Tyler Johnson, John Mark, Sorelli, Coleman. Yes, Trevor Zajac on my fourth line. That's not a bad line. Victor Hedman, Sirkachev, Eric Stahl's on my fourth. Wow, minus three. Wow, people just don't like Mark Stahl. I can see why he was traded. So he will be on my trade list next. And then goalies, we got. Bassy and flurry. That's 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 a good starting goaltender and backup. So we are fifth. Where do we need to be? We need to be thirty-one and twenty-six. Thirty. Thirty. Another thing is in the upcoming season, I'm gonna have a lot of like rookie guys that are gonna be worth too much. Frankly, don't care. Seventy-three percent ain't bad. So I'm back in fifth. I'm in the same spot I'm in. I just have to make the playoffs. Fourth. Fifth. How have I not clinched a playoff spot? How have I not clinched a playoff spot? I'm sorry, but what? So right now, I think we're in the east. Because right now our wild card is to the Aces and Lumberjacks. 
with 43. Where are we in this list? Not far behind. We're two games behind. We're literally two games behind. Where are we in the lineup? I don't think we made the playoffs. Nope. That means we need to win the next four games. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. How do I... We give up four to the Blades in the first period. Okay. They've done just that, and they lead as a result. The Blades have played in their own end. Can't find his man. The North there we go. Scores a little too sweet of the numbers pile up. Really good play to get himself into position. Now he's got 50 points on the year. There's one timer. There you go. That's two. The fact that my team is not winning games to me is surprising. Okay, I guess I can just walk in. That's a goal. End of the period. So we're down by one. Going into the third. Feeling good. There's still some improvement, but. Oh, that's a. Yeah. That was a really bad play. Oh, I missed the net. That's a goal. There's Stahl. Isn't the guy I just picked up the trade deadline? I doubt it. I can come back. But it is only one goal. Oh! What a rocket. Ryan McDonough. What a rocket. Kemper trying to play stand up. Couldn't get his glove Minneapolis, this even things up, up high enough. Quick enough. Donna with the big hit. Coming in clutch. Thirty seconds. Oh, we got flurry. Overtime. Along with Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabolski here. Oh, and it's four on four. Because I set the new rules that way. That's right. We don't play three on three. Underway, Ferraro. Next goal in. Steel City's got a hold of it against the wall. Because I think three on three is dumb. He almost lost it for a second there, but I like the four on four. Here's an odd man run. Oh. Oh, there you go. That's a win. That's a win. Now I don't even know if I can still make the playoffs. <laughs> how are we third in our division? And how how are we not getting 
what are we super behind in points or something? So we need 96 points to have a wild card. So we're down by two in points. So that's that's one game. And we're playing Shattuck. Come on, beat him. Are you serious? We lost to Shattuck. And now, now we're not going to make the playoffs. <laughs> wow. We even had a really good year, too. I didn't see how did our, our AHL team do. Well, they advanced. Or they still have two games left. They still have two games left. Where are they? They're last. 31 and 41. Question is who's going to win the cup? <clears throat> wow, it's going to be Dubuque. It's South St. Paul, which is fair. They they had they did pretty good. They won. Good for them. The Steers beat the Owls. And we made negative 4 million this year. So we're going to trade a bunch of players. <clears throat> 